Okay, I'm back. I decided to change everything up. Sorry about the lighting. I gotta do some more research and get that done. So, today I got something new to talk about. Something that's been heavy on me to actually do a video about since last year. Um, I didn't get the chance to do it, so let's just talk about it. In case you're wondering, by the way, since this is YouTube, I have to explain myself. I'm now wearing my wedding ring, but it is because my fingers are fat now. Well, fatter. So, there's our joke for tonight. I'm trying to loosen things up. Okay, so anyway, I can't fit my wedding ring because my fingers are too fat. So, we're going to work on that, honey bun. Okay, y'all, so, what I want to talk about is, um, grief during the holidays, because when I was very young, I lost my dad, and I was 12, so it was, it's been really hard, um, especially since my birthday is in December, so, it, hmm, uh, yeah, it's hard. And, um, this year, I know a lot of people have lost loved ones. I have lost loved ones this year. Um, and another type of person, I guess I should say, I also lost my, <sighs> I lost my dog this year, y'all. I had had her since, um, ninth grade. And I am now 25. So, yeah, it's, yeah, we had her for nine years. So, anyway, grief during the holidays. Um, I just want to give my spin on it and see, and maybe there's something that I can say that will help somebody else. So, what I like to say, first of all, is losing a loved one is extremely difficult, um, and it just, it takes time to learn how to cope there I feel like you never get over it you just learn to cope now there are good ways and bad ways to cope I have learned to seek God and look back on good memories um especially when it comes to my dad because he was my best friend my I don't know. He was just, he was my heart. He meant everything to me. So, I would just like to encourage you all, if you have lost a loved one, and, you know, we're still going through the holidays currently. Christmas, you know, we're going to blink, and it's going to be Christmas. So, I'm sure it is going to be difficult this year for lots of people, but try to look back on the times that you did have with them especially when things were normal because right now y'all know the state of the world we don't even see our loved ones like we want to so i encourage you to try to remember the good times something that's funny you know fun memories it helps a lot um and take things one moment at a time i'm not even gonna say a day one moment and just remember that death is a part of life, but you learn to thank God for the beautiful people and the beautiful moments that you have had with your loved ones. Um, I feel like after my dad died, I cherished, cherished, sorry, I cherished my family even more, um, yeah, take it one moment at a time. It gets better in some aspects, but it can also still be hard. Just know that you're not alone, and you're going to get through it. Because if I can make it through it, then so can you. It's, yeah. Anyway, I was just checking in with y'all, and like I said, I wanted to do this video so, if it's okay, I want to close out with a quick, quick prayer. And, um, 
you know, I'll see y'all in the next video. So, let's just pray real quick. Dear God, we come asking that the person watching this video, God, that you give them strength during this time, this holiday season. Lord, you see what they're going through. You know exactly how they feel, God. You know them more better than they know themselves. So, God, we just ask that you touch their heart, give them strength to make it through this. God, this situation in their life where you are able to do anything but fail. So, Lord, we look to you. You are our help and you are our strength. God, I ask that you give this person strength and give them wisdom on how to make it through the situation. Help them to lean and depend on you. For you are our Father. You are our Shepherd, oh God. Lord, you are our comfort. Send your Holy Spirit to comfort them even now. Let them feel your love, God, that is never ending, oh God. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Alright, y'all. So, leave comments below if there's anything that I can say to encourage you. Send you a virtual hug, you know. I'll do that. So, y'all be blessed. And I will see y'all in the next video. Until then, stay strong. Y'all help me with some kind of saying at the end of the videos, because my brain, you know. But I'll see y'all later. Bye.